guys welcome back to my reaction channel today we're going to react to bleach episode 9 now guys in the last episode a whole lot happened okay rukia is in trouble in more ways than one okay and and looks like ichigo and her are starting to develop this deep emotional connection because they were pretty much running right beside each other and, and communicating telepathically right and she told them that she understands and that when he's ready to open up to her she, she'll be there right and then we have this soul reaper that's here to to punish Rukia, but it seems like he's about to help Ichigo save his sisters because there's this ginormous hollow that's actually trying to kill him right now and I think he might be after Ichigo because of his spirit energy and I, I, I think no matter how you look at it looks like Ichigo was responsible for his mother's death but man listen this is all over the place okay I'm very excited because they're they're building up on this uh, soul society and, and sending people here and they're like badass strong and they're like punish and this and that you know and, and the soul society isn't all sunshine and rainbows they they had their faults as well right we we saw the the, the mod soul and all that so guys i ain't gonna prolong this that much if you enjoy my reactions feel free to share subscribe like leave a comment ring that bell for notifications guys follow me on instagram join my discord server and my patreon page without further ado man let's jump right into this reaction let's go yep they're all in trouble You're too noisy. Hmm? Ichigo is here. That's one ugly hollow. One hostage is all I need. I've been waiting for you, Soul Reaper. Damn. Damn, this is getting exciting, man, and also worrisome. Oh, now that's an ugly one. <laughs> yeah, that's what I said. What the hell is? He tried to stay when he was younger and that's why his mom died, bruh. No way. What? Is this the same hollow? Is that what they're trying to do right now? Because that little girl, I'm pretty sure that little girl looked the same as the one he, you know, ran towards. Wait, man, listen. Yeah, yeah, I, oh, let, let's. Yeah, I think he reckoned, yeah, yeah, yeah. Possible. The girl I saw that day six years ago. Exactly. I went down by the river. I tried to stop her from jumping into the river, but when I finally came to, she disappeared. That's the same hollow. Six years ago. That's a long time. You can't expect me to remember every one of the souls I've eaten. <laughs> what? What the hell? <laughs> it's Grand Fisher. That's the code name we've given him. He keeps himself invisible and disguises the lure growing out of his head as a human. For over 50 years, this hollow has evaded every soul reaper that's gone after him. 50 years? We know his favorite victims are women. So does that mean no my way. mother was actually killed by... Bruh. Impressive. You have been lucky, little boy. You saw my lure and yet you lived. But there's something about the women. Uh, I saw that she was slashed. <laughs> That's the most disgusting hollow I've seen in a long time. Bruh, that, bruh, for 50 years he was able to evade every soul reaper. Yeah, that's one strong hollow. So the little girl he saw, I thought that little girl was being chased by this hollow. And, and that's why, you know, Ichigo trying to save that little spirit or whatever. He got in the way and, and that's how his mom died protecting him from something this hollow, right? But it's actually a part of his body. That's how he lures his victims, his his. Pray, bro, that's messed up. And the fact that Rukia knows about him, he's famous, man. 50 years of aiding punishment, man. Okay, and now Ichiko is face to face with his mom's killer on the day of, of the anniversary of her death, bro. That's just messed up. That's really messed up, man. I knew it was deep. I knew. Don't be so reckless, you idiot. Huh? The hell? Wood style? <laughs> or fur style? I knew you were ugly, but up close you smell worse. Disintegrate, okay. you black dog of Rondonini. Okay. How dare you interfere? Bruh, yeah, what are you thinking? You don't have power. Yeah, this 
Motherfucker, bro, you're there. Help them, okay? Yeah, man, come on, okay? Declare divine judgment later, punishment, whatever for Rukia later. Just save him right now, man. His sisters didn't do anything. You're just your soul reaper, right? You're just standing here and saying, yo, he's ugly and not doing anything. He's pissing me off, man. The samurai, right? Okay, okay. I think Ichiko's got this. I don't know how, but brah, Rukia's bleeding right now. <laughs> now just sit there and watch as I devour this little girl. <laughs> it's better than him to watch. Yeah, he's gonna help. He's gonna help. He looks ugly. He got him. Yeah, I knew he was going for the kill. Wait, he, he's, he's done? Why? One and done? Tell me. <laughs> I'm a wow. soul reaper kid. And we fight hollows. We kill them without mercy no matter what. We must always protect the innocent. Uh, That's respect up. right there. Honor. You hear me? Get up! No, he's he done. He can't die, can he? Ichigo, even soul reapers are not immortal. If the injuries are severe enough. Huh? Is he... Wait a minute, he's only sleeping. Bro, this Tell man's jokes. Like, how you gonna create such a dramatic stabbing and then he just fell asleep? Like, what? And yeah, okay, so now we know this information that uh, they're not immortal. And we know that about Shinigami as well. If they stop right, writing names in their, their little book, notebook, they're gonna die, right? And, and they're too afraid to stop, so just they just keep writing even though there's nothing left in their world. So it's kind of the same concept because they're also Shinigami, man. I love combining information from... Okay, okay, that's dope. So this guy wasn't all that strong if it took this creature to just defeat him that easily, right? He's one and done. I mean, he might not be dead, but he's still unconscious. But then I guess this this... Creature has been evading Soul Reapers for 50 years, so it ain't a joke, man. This creature is strong. Tell him to get up, or I'll kill him. Wow, this dude looks like he's leaking. <laughs> Come, take Ichigo's sisters and run. <laughs> run where? Just, hurry, Just run. Right. I have to do this for my mother. Man, fact. Be out of this. Facts. You lost your mind? This house no, is he lost his mother thanks to that monstrosity. Yeah, I would do the same, man. F everything. I'm gonna, man. Being the best of soul reapers for 50 years, he's way too strong for That's you to enough. take on. Doesn't matter. Now, please, uh. don't interfere. Or try to help me. This is a matter of respect. It's all mine. Yeah. Man. That's a lot of whatever those are tentacles. Rock, wow, he's strong as hell. He looks like a rat with that a mask. That's pretty brave of you, young soul reaper, telling your friend you didn't need any help from her to fight me. Pretty brave and pretty stupid. You see, there's a type of fish that lives in very deep waters and it's yeah you m must have seen it that's how they hunt they have that you know thing in front of their head that you know has light and since it's very deep it's dark in th those waters so that light attracts other fish and then the rest of the body appears and eats those fish so that's how they lure their prey so i i would assume i, I wonder if this creature hollow creature was inspired by that type of fish right because it has a similar you know and they use that lure as a human they explained it earlier it's dope but it does look like a rat with a mask man <clears throat> so evil yeah, we man. must always protect the innocent. I've also made it my duty to protect the innocent. I guess you didn't Too listen slow. when your friend told you not to be so reckless. Today's the day your luck finally ran out, maggot! Oh no! He can do that? Man, listen, this creature is just... Oh, it's pissing me off. Somebody needs to kill this thing. That'll teach you to be so reckless, amateur soul reaper. And now you'll endure the shame of dying without even having wounded the great grand fisher. I'll do this my way. Whatever it takes. No matter what it costs. Even if I die. 
I'm gonna Damn. finish this. I shall show you why your mind is not strong enough to fight me either. Behold! He's gonna his mom. Yeah, I knew it. Oh, this is messed up. Is that your mother? Man. Even the most cold-blooded soul reaper has one person whom he can never kill. By this is so messed up, man. They did the same thing in Parasite, right? When, when Shinichi fought that thing that went inside his mom and that he needed to kill the remaining parts of her of his mom, even though her soul wasn't, she wasn't there, right? Man, that's so messed up. And now this thing, yeah, it's kind of flaunting. I guess in this case, it's a bit easier because it's not really his mom. It's not her body that he needs to chop up, right? But yeah, this, this thing is diabolical, it's very skillful, and it, it just said pure facts, right? He's dulling his blade by being so emotional and jumping into things without, you know, thinking them through and uh, actually having a strategy. So that's kind of why this thing is able to read him like an open book and evade every attack. Plus, it's probably way more experienced and, and, and agile and, and quicker, right? So, yeah, Ichigo is in a huge disadvantage if he doesn't get, I don't know, a power-up or just some divine inspiration from his mom to chop up this thing in the name of revenge. I don't see him winning, man. Learning who that person is, I have evaded every soul reaper who has come before you for over 50 years. Do you remember me, Ichigo? <laughs> Ichigo! <sighs> You're forgetting something. Huh? What, what about his honor? You want to help, and if you lend him your strength now, he will probably be saved. But in doing so, you will have forever destroyed his honor. We must always be careful to distinguish between the two. There is the battle to protect innocent life, and then... There is the battle to preserve one's honor. This is a battle for Ichigo's honor, and one he must fight alone. Bro! I cannot lend him my strength. I must not help him. <laughs> I just got chills. What the hell was that? Who was that wise man spitting facts right there, right? It seems like she had a flashback because she had a sword. Like she was in a battle before this. And then somebody stopped her from interfering. She was... She was already in a situation like this, only this time she was able to recognize on her own that he's battling for his honor. And if she jumps in, she's gonna... Man, okay, okay. Look at where he stabbed him, straight through the heart. How the hell is this man even standing? But... Don't sacrifice yourself, Ichigo. Man. Damn, I fell asleep again. How dare you defile her memory by bringing her into this? You disgusting freak! You make me sick! Uh, Ichigo, you mustn't do this. You mustn't hurt your mother. Please, son, you must put your sword down. Snap out of it! Do it for me. Yeah, he's right behind her. Brock, he got him again! Come on, Ichigo! Your rage only serves to dull your blade. It makes you vulnerable. And now with my next blow, I'll finish you off. Having faced so many soul reapers, you were the most foolish and by far the weakest of them all. Damn. What? What is happening? What is that? Is that you? What? How? Wait, I was right? She's gonna intervene and somehow help? That can only mean what? that the lure recorded her thoughts at the very moment she was killed. Oh? Ichigo. <laughs> proud. My son, I'm very proud of you. You and your father and Kari and Yuzu, I am so lucky to have had those years with all of you. Man. Ichigo, live on, my son. Live with strength and kindness and never lose that smile. Man, he lost a long time ago. Ichigo, thank you for loving me. Maybe this is gonna bring it back. The smile. Yeah, this is gonna give him strength, man. Mother. Mother. Now I know what your last thoughts were. You say anger dulls the blade. You may be right about that. Yeah. But there's something else that you haven't considered. To kill a slimy scumbag like you. A dull blade like this one is all that I need! Damn! Damn, he stabbed him! Damn. Okay! Atta boy! You haven't seen the last of me! You'll burn for this someday! Wait, he retreated? Coward! What? 
He didn't get his revenge. It won't be over until I've killed him. Uh, I have to. I will go. avenge my mother. <laughs> now what's messed up is that this guy's awake and ready to assault a Rukia or him if he deems fit, right? Because he still hasn't gotten his answer. He needs to, you know, take something back to the higher ups. And now that Ichigo defeated the monster, he's free to do pretty much anything since there's nobody to stop him since Ichigo is out of commission. Damn, but I feel how he feels, man. That that thing retreated like a coward, right? It 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 just vanished, and I guess it lived to fight another day. And Ichigo is just full of regret here. But at least he got to hear his mom's last words and, and see that she's not blaming him or anything. He he need man. This is well done, man. The way they're connecting all these characters. I'm glad you didn't die today, Ichigo. I'm so thankful. This kid's potential is a little frightening. Damn, that's Breeze. Well, time for me to head home. Really? Okay, have <laughs> it your way. But you know the Soul Society is going to find out eventually. Oh, so he's not gonna tell them? Bye, Rukia. Good luck. He's not gonna tell Say them. Goodbye to the kid for me. Damn, so Ichigo won him over. He's not gonna tattletale. I'm so sorry, mother. I tried to avenge your death, but I guess I failed you. Dad, those were private thoughts. <laughs> you shouldn't eavesdrop. Hey, I thought you quit smoking. Your mom told me once, back when we'd only been dating for a little while, and she thought I looked cool holding a cigarette. <laughs> but now that I think about it, that might have been the first compliment she ever gave me. That's why I always smoke just one when I come here. Yeah. On this one day of the year. Just like she came out with Asuma, man. How can you smile about anything here? Why doesn't anyone blame me for causing mom's death? Bruh! It'd be so much easier to understand if you all blame me. It's not your fault! Why should we blame yeah, you? Yeah, man. If I were ever to blame you for having caused your mother's death, she'd never forgive me. It's no one's fault that she died. Facts! And remember this. That woman whom I loved so much was willing to give up her own life to protect yours. Man. Wow, Dad. True. Be strong, Ichigo. Live well, grow old well, grow bald well, and then die long after I've died. And if possible, die with a smile on your face. Otherwise, I'll never be able to face Misaki. Man, that was low-key deep for a guy that... Are you listening, Rukia? I want you to let me be a Soul Reaper for a little while longer, so I can continue to protect the innocent from hollows. I must become strong enough to defeat any hollow, especially this grand yeah. fisher. I can't face my mother again until I've killed him. Jesus, now he has a goal. Is that it? Nobody knows who I really this soundtrack I never felt this deserves to be played after such a scene. It's light to guide your boat, man. I don't know what is it about this ending, but it somehow sets the mood perfectly, especially after such an emotional episode and scene and then, you know? And that was really wise of his dad to say those words, man, right? Man, he was, uh, for a man that, you know, gut kicks his child every chance he has, he, he, he's wise, man. He's just hiding uh, behind that facade of, of, of you know, smiles and because and, he doesn't want to he wants to raise happy, you know, children, and that's what he said to Ichigo here. He's like, smile, man, try to shake off that depression. And those final words might actually help him, you know, move forward with his life. But here we see that he just wants to continue being a soul reaper and, and get even stronger. So one day he might be able to, with ease, avenge his mother. He actually said that he's not gonna see her until he's, you know, done with that creature. So that's kind of... Bah, yeah, a whole lot happened here. That Soul Reaper went away and he's like, okay, but they're gonna find out sometime, right? That the Soul Society, so brah, okay. They're just, they're, they're foreshadowing that Soul Society so much so that I really wanna see it. I really wanna freaking see it. What the hell is that about? And if that guy is... Right, there must be some powerful dudes out there, right, to, 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 that gave commands and all that. 
yeah, this was a lovely episode. We we learned, we finally learned the backstory of, of, of Ichigo and how he lost his mom and how he blamed himself and how it really actually happened. We learned alongside Ichigo because he didn't know either. So that was the that was the hollow that used pretty much mirages of people that that are yeah. He he lured them in with bait basically. Damn. But he ran away like a coward, that hollow. So yeah, he's not really honorable. He's just a piece of work, right? So guys, listen, that's all I have for you today. I really enjoyed this episode. Hope you enjoyed the reaction. And I'll see you in the next one. Damn, that, that almost made me cry a couple of times during this episode. My my eyes got teary. It's just, yeah, it was well done. The, the, the soundtrack set the scene, the, the speeches and all that. Yeah, yeah, I can totally see why this anime is good and why you guys like it so much. So yeah, I'm going to be jumping right into the next one. But that's it for today, guys. Stay safe, love you, enjoy, and bye.